I went through my comment section and in general what that comment was explaining that there is a person that repented and after repentance they continue to sin and it makes them think if their initial repentance was even real and if God is really going to forgive them for continuing to sin after repentance. I hope this makes sense. And let me say this. When you give your life to Jesus Christ, I don't believe you are going to do everything right. If you have been sinning for so long, let's say you have been sinning for three years, five years, 20 years, or higher. How are you going to quickly start doing things right? Like, if you have been sinning for so long, how are you going to completely stop that and begin doing the right thing in every situation? How is that possible? From my understanding, we have to grow in Jesus Christ. You know, when you are a child, you are supposed to grow. I believe you are supposed to grow in knowledge and behavior or whatever else. So in Christ, I believe we have to grow in his rules. If you are growing, I believe you are going to make mistakes. Like if you have ever written, ridden a bike, maybe you had to start with training wheels and then after training wheels you may have fallen off your bike many times now maybe you can ride a bike without falling i hope this makes sense so just because you may sin doesn't mean that your repentance was not true What is, re what is repentance? I believe repentance is a change of mind. So I believe a change in mind will eventually result in a change in behavior. Look, you are from my knowledge, which is very limited. I believe you are going to fail as in do many things wrong while trying to live for Jesus Christ. But don't let that stop you. Even though you may fail, continue placing effort in trying to do what is right. I fail. I make mistakes, but I continue trying to do what is right because why give up and accept your fate in hell? Why? Listen, 
I believe God looks at our heart. Even though we may fail a lot, if we have the intention in trying to do what is right, repenting, asking God for forgiveness, but our heart is to do what is right, I believe that counts in the eyes of God. I hope this makes sense. I believe there are some people who want to do what is wrong, but may ask God for forgiveness. But they want to continue doing what is wrong. Like their heart is like, I don't want to change, but I want to do what is wrong. Now, if they ask for forgiveness, is their forgiveness true? I don't think so. Why? Because of their intentions, their heart. They want to continue doing what is wrong, but they think if they ask God for forgiveness, God is going to forgive them, even though they want to do what is wrong. No. If you are human, I believe you are going to fail many times. Yes, you can grow in Christ, but I believe you are going to fail many times and you may ask me, what do growing in Christ mean? I believe you can improve in following God's rules. Like you may have a very bad temper now. As years pass by, or time, your attitude problem will get better. Or you may have a lust problem. Maybe back in the past, you would fall into lust so many times. Now, it may be once a week or once every six months or something like that, as if you are seeing progress in your behavior. That is what I mean by growing in Christ, growing in the things of God behavior-wise or anything that pertains to that. So, if you fail, don't see it as a sign to give up. Like, this isn't for me because I continue to make mistakes. I believe making mistakes is normal. Yes, we should aim for perfection, but Even though you may not be perfect, continue trying to live righteously, to live according to God's rules. I hope this makes sense. There is no reason to give up. Even though you may feel embarrassed by sinning, even though you may feel like God is not going to forgive you. Continue doing what is right, even though you may fail. You don't truly fail, in my eyes, unless you totally give up on Jesus Christ. So, making mistakes is normal, but... Have your heart set on trying to change. Have your heart set on like, hey, 
I dislike sinning and I am trying to do what is right. Let me stop here. God bless you.